Hello and welcome. This is Crypto's Chain with simple cryptocurrency news, and I've got some great news for you that came in today. These are from Neoname Service and the City of Zion. You're gonna love them. Let's get straight in. Now, on Neoname Service Twitter page, they've made an announcement. The domain name auction on NNS Mainnet is back, and the domain name ownership transfer function is also available. You can transfer a domain name from a Neo address to another. Now, the community has been asking for it, and now they finally got it. Let's move straight in to the NL wallet okay this is where you've got your domain name now I'm already logged in so what you need to do is go to the NNS tab after that you need to go to the domain management tab and here you can see that I've already got the domain name cryptoschain.neo assigned to me okay this is my address resolver and my address mapping and it's valid for one entire year from the moment that I won the bid you need to go to edit and you need to type in the owner's public address. Now, this is the new owner's public address. If you want to sell your domain name to somebody, you need to get their public address, paste it in here, click the button set owner, and boom, that's it, you're done. Now, how can you do that safely with people you don't know? Well, as you know, as you've probably guessed, there's the trusted, the trusted, and the reason I say trusted is because you have to rely on an escrow on Telegram, Cryptoholics domain. I am going to post a link to their telegram group okay they have been dealing with many um, over-the-counter NEP5 tokens ERC20 tokens and so on but now they've also got another telegram group which deals with domain name selling and buying okay so that's where you can go ahead and find some people that may be interested in your domain name or maybe you just want to buy a domain name it's as simple as that you can use your trusted escrow to do that transfer. So yes, it's pretty cool. And finally, the piece of news from today is about the City of Zion Neon Wallet version 2.0 is out. Now, so the City of Zion releases Neon Wallet V2 featuring a complete design overhaul. Now, I'm not gonna talk through the whole news, but I just wanna say some of the cool stuff that you can find in this new wallet interface besides the interface, okay, is, is, the NEP9 URI scheme. Now, what is NEP9? Now, NEP9 allows for the creation of QR codes that contain all the necessary information to quickly send assets across the network without the risk of incorrect data entry. So we have seen it for Bitcoin. Now we're seeing it for NEO. It's absolutely great. NEO is really progressing. And wait until I tell you the last piece of news, which is the greatest one. Let's move down. And, and, and it's about the node selection. Now I'm going to read this part. So the node selection, right, the settings page remains mostly unchanged and offers similar functionality to older versions, including the ability to switch between block explorers and currencies. However, it can now be accessed via the settings tab rather than requiring users to log out first and allows users to switch between two themes as desired. One useful new feature is the ability to manually select which nodes the wallet uses to synchronize with the NEO blockchain. This will allow users to easily switch from nodes that are not completely transmitting transactions, providing them with access to a simple troubleshooting step if the wallet is not functioning as intended. So this is absolutely great. Okay, why do I say this is great? Because you know, we people have been complaining that NEO had transaction problems and we know they've had transaction problems, okay? Um, and this is this is the solution, guys. This is the solution. You can finally change the node. When you have problems, use the new node. And this is how the wallet looks. Okay, I have it downloaded already. It's absolutely amazing. It's really cutting edge design. It has a graph of the price. It has your portfolio value. It has the token balances. It is loading at the moment. Okay, I need to retry. Or I can select a different node. So I've got the contacts. I've got the token sale. Okay, so I can see my portfolio here. I've got the activity, okay, of all the transfers that I've done. I've got the send functionality, and in the send functionality, as you can see, you can select whichever tokens you currently hold. You type in the recipient's address like we're used to, but the interesting part is you can prioritize your transaction with a fee, and you've got the different options here. You've got the fast 0.001 drops of gas. You've got the faster 0.05, and the fastest, which is 0.1. It is quite expensive because it's about 48 cents considering the current gas price at the moment, okay? But yes, it can be done. So yes, this is great. And you've got the token sale feature. You can, you can take part in the token sale. They had this in the older version of the Neon Wallet, but it looks cooler here. And of course, we've got the settings tab. Okay, and in the settings tab, we've got the theme. You can select between dark and light. 
Okay, I don't really like the light one, I like the dark one more. You can select the currency, the block explorer, you've got a neon scan, neo scan, sorry, neo tracker and ant chain. You can select between mainnet and testnet and you've got the node selection which is the new feature and you can see here these are all the different nodes, top 15 are listed, you can refresh the page, it tells you how many milliseconds it takes to synchronize the node and you can select the node as well if you're interested. I've got it to select automatically because right now I don't find any problems. So yeah, this is absolutely amazing. I really, really like what they've done. They really surprised us with this um, with this new wallet. I gotta tell you that. So let's see what the competition has to bring. Okay, this is what we're looking forward to. That's all I wanted to cover for today. If you're new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe. I would really appreciate your support. And also don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it. Hit the thumbs up, I'd really appreciate that. Have a lovely day, enjoy it. Please leave a comment below. Just in case you have any sort of comments, any sort of doubts, I will be able to answer your questions. And if not, I'll be asking the right people to get the answers for you. Thank you very much once again. Enjoy your day and see you in my next video. Goodbye.